US President Joe Biden and his Vice President Kamala Harris have made their first public appearance together since Joe Biden dropped out of the race. Our Washington correspondent Annalise Nielsen joins us live now. Annalise, Joe Biden was happy to hit the campaign trail again. Yeah, look, he looks like he's a bit more, got a bit more bounce in his step. Now he's back on the campaign trail supporting Kamala Harris instead. He did say he felt like he needed a bit more time off and he's certainly getting it at the moment. The focus is very much on Kamala Harris. But this is the first time we've seen them together since Joe Biden stepped down. Again, we still haven't had a press conference from Kamala Harris since she took that top spot on the ticket. It's been over 24 days now. She hasn't spoken with a journalist beyond responding to some questions on the tarmac, getting on planes. So this was their moment to celebrate uh, what they say their administration's done to bring down prescription drug prices, but they didn't miss the opportunity to take a swipe at Donald Trump. With the guy we're running against, what's his name? <laughs> Donald Dumper, Donald. Whatever. Pete, and the big thing, we haven't had a response from either the Harris campaign or the White House via the president himself this week is about this extraordinary footage that's come out of Afghanistan. This is the Taliban's playing with all the equipment that the US left behind exactly three years ago during that chaotic withdrawal. The estimates at the time were around seven billion US dollars worth of equipment that's been left there. So it's an extraordinary juxtaposition as they go back on the campaign trail to have this footage. So I thought I would play that for our viewers again. And we're just standing by to hear from Donald Trump himself. Yeah. He's holding a press conference from New Jersey in uh, just about 20 minutes. Yep. And that'll be live here once we see it. Thanks, Annalise. Talk to you soon.